What is up everybody and welcome to the install tutorial for fossils and archaeology revival build 0002 for Minecraft 1.4.7. So they did just update this so I am just trying to make this video nice and quick. You'll find three links in the description. The first one will be to WinBar which you'll need to extract the files and stuff like that. The second one will be to this page which is the actual fossils and archaeology revival page. So what you're going to want to do is when you get to this page, page you're going to want to go to download and installation and you're going to want to click on fossils and archaeology revival and you, you can either hit the direct download or the ad fly download you want to give them some extra money you appreciate the mod I recommend clicking the ad fly download so then the third link will be to this page and then after this one is done this is to Minecraft Forge and after this is done you can hit skip ad here but you cannot do these two at the same time then you're gonna want to do you want to hit re uh, go to downloads ad fly and hit recommended and click on universal and this will open up another ad fly link so just download these two pretty simple and straightforward I'm sure most of you know how to do this and you just want to wait your three seconds and get this out and done so then once you have those two downloaded, you're going to want to open up Minecraft. So if you already cleared your jar and all that, you don't have to do this step. But again, this is just wiping out your jar and you're going to want to do this just as a safety regard so you don't screw anything up when you install Minecraft Forge. So while it is doing that, you want to go to the start menu and type in run and then click on the run program. Then type in percent app data percent and hit OK. Then you want to open up dot Minecraft and go to your First, you want to go to your mods folder just to clear out any mods you have in there. There's my old fossils and archaeology version. You can just delete that, and uh, once Minecraft finishes, you can close it. And then once you have that done, you're going to want to go into your bin. You're going to want to click on this Minecraft, and you want to right-click and hit Open with WinVar Archiver. And then once you're in here, you want to delete MetaInf and just you know hit delete on that and enter. And you want to go to the folder where you downloaded both of your things and open up Minecraft Forge Universal. So you could hit Control A or just highlight everything in that folder and drag and drop it into your Minecraft.jar. So then it will do its thing. It will prompt you. Just hit OK. And now it is all extracted in there, and you have technically installed Minecraft Forge. So then you could just X out of those, and if this is your first time doing it, you will have to launch Minecraft to get this mods folder. So we can, you can close out of everything except that one folder you're in your Minecraft, where your Minecraft.jar is and your app data and stuff like that. So if it's your first time, you will not have a mods folder, and you have to run it once. So just do that for good measure anyway, and then you can go back to your mods folder, and then you go to your fossils and archaeology folder, so show in folder, and you double click on this, and you take whatever is in the zip, and you drag and drop it into the mods folder and you let it do its thing it's in there and now you have actually successfully installed fossils and archaeology build 0002 so i'll just show you all that it's done as minecraft loads and there you go so i thank you all for watching i do hope you enjoyed i hope i helped you guys out and again links in the description